Now, Matthew reported Darren to the community board president who declined participating today. Do you give any credence at all to any of their complaints or do you think they're just completely off the wall? Honestly, I'm doing me, man. You know when you say you do, that's what I go by, you do you. If it's, if it's <clears throat> making me feel good, I don't care what they think, dude. You think I give a crap what they think? Well, apparently okay, not. Here's the, here's the thing. Here's the thing. Do what, here's do the what thing, you do. Do what you do inside your own walls. What? Here's the problem. Do what you do inside your own walls. Okay. You can't do what you do when you live in a gated community, a townhouse gated community. When you connect, the houses are connected. It oh, affects bring everybody. Them into my house That's then the and biggest let them problem. The That's the biggest problem. Is that you you doing this nonsense? has now affected everybody. Here's the thing, it just says warning, beware of alligators, snakes, and unknown wildlife in the area. No mm -hmm. swimming, fishing, boating, don't feed any wildlife, keep your distance. Yeah, uh, it doesn't say don't feed iguanas, it's not specific. Alligator, snake, and unknown wildlife. Unknown is not an iguana, iguana is known. It says don't feed any wildlife. But it's a, uh, it's not specific. It's that is a that's not black and white. It's red and white, and it's also in a gray area. It says do not feed any wildlife. Well, guess what? They're not wildlife to me. So in my head, it's not wildlife. It's my friend. And I'm if if you're feeding a homeless person and the person over here is mad because there's a homeless person in their area. Iguanas are not homeless. They live in the pond. But they depend on me. No, they don't. Yes, they do. There are thousands of them down there that get by and have never met you. They don't listen to your but music. The few, the, they don't come to your house. But the ones that do like me and love me and have a vibe toward me, they expect me to come outside and feed well, them. They don't have expectations. The, you, they you need, do. You just look, don't know. You need to get a life, not a lizard. You don't know. They're, Florida Wildlife says there is an infestation yes, of there iguanas. Yes, but not in my yard. Yes, you're drawing them into your yeah, yard. Yes, so I could take care of and them and I can control the population. And you're feeding them out of your mouth and they have salmonella. that You can get botulism. Yeah, well, this can cause paralysis. Did I ever get that in my paralysis? No, I'm not. I got bit by the iguana. Did I get salmonella? No. Not I put peroxide yet. on it. Not yet. I mean, it's been months. I'm not like, I don't get stuff like that because I am out in the nature. Do I look infected? I'm not infected. Let me ask you a question. If you love the iguanas yeah. and your neighbors don't, yes. and you want to be mature about this, why don't you go to the iguanas? I'm sure there's a pond or a marsh around there where they hang out and tell iguana jokes. They and, do. It's out on and, the, It's right out back there. Yeah, it's like 20 can, feet from the patio. Then you can go out to where they are, but don't draw them into the houses where they eat the vegetation and burrow under the patios but and I that sort of But I can't do that. I have a relationship with them already. You can have a relationship with them where no, they I, live. And then it's going to be worse. And they're going to be like, oh, he's going down to the pond. Like, I'm on my own property. So if they come to me, it's like not a big deal. But if I go down into the common ground, that's when they're going to get me. I have. He's probably got it all planned out with the board and everything. They're you waiting for that. You you have completely lost your mind. You probably you, you know, I, told you this have doctor. lost your mind. Listening to you right now, listening to you right now, listen, I thought you were bad. Hearing hearing how you're breaking this down, I, I don't even know if there's any hope you for you. You probably got with the doctor and and the board and told them, let's tell him to go to the to the lake and play with the iguanas, and then we're gonna get them. Because yeah. then they I got did. video I footage. Yeah. You're right. You know yeah. what? I sent this I sent is, big you, I sent big text this messages is, and I let her know. You, you caught us. This is Iguana Gate. Do you have a story or a question for me? Click the link in the description and tell me what in the world is going on.